In this video, I'll show you how to create and save custom render settings in DaVinci Resolve. More or less how to create your own presets if you work with projects that are identical and you want to have the same exact export settings for your projects. So assumption here is that you're done creating your video. So I've got my video with some subtitles here, ATC. It's just a video that I just dropped in. Now let's click on deliver and from this section, we are going to ch make our changes for whatever options we want to do. So we can call it, let's say what, export preset. And let's say we want to change the different formats here. Uh, let's assume it was in QuickTime. You change maybe to MP4, codec H264 or H265, whatever that, uh, that you want. Uh, and then let's assume the resolution of your video or your video clips that you need to use the same preset for are in a different dimension. Let's say uh, 1280 by 720, click on that. And then the frame rate probably is the same. Uh, let's go with 24. Quality, go with the best. Uh, encoding profile, uh, whatever you want to choose here, just leave it as it is for now. And then you can click on advanced settings, pixel aspect ratio, square, data levels, whatever, if you know what you're doing inside this particular section of the advanced settings, you can enable all that. So as for the subtitle settings, if you create videos with subtitles, then you may need to export the subtitle as let's assume ban into video, that is a subtitle. And then once you're satisfied with your edits to save your preset, that is your export preset, just come up here, click on these three dots. It's not easily identifiable, but just click on these three dots, click on save as new preset, and then you can call it whatever, uh, 1280 by 720 with subtitles. Okay, click okay. And once you do that, you'll see a new uh, custom preset here. Uh, uh, of, uh, other than what is available. So if you actually go back to the edit page, let's assume you're done with your project or future projects, just click on deliver. And then once you come inside here, just look for your preset, click on it, and everything is going to be as you want it or need it to be. And then you can either add to render queue or whatever that you want. But that is how you can create and save your custom render settings or just basically create an export preset in DaVinci Resolve. Thanks for watching this video. My name is David and until next time, stay safe and never stop learning.